Hi, I'm Jennifer, and I am currently in YTE, Youth Tech Entrepreneur Class, which is a class designed to make websites for nonprofit organizations. So this is our YTE class, 2013. This picture was taken after we decided what um, each partner was going to participate in doing in the teacher website, MST teacher website. This is our current MST website. Give a little about the school news pictures. At the beginning when we first started, um, everybody emailed what they thought was a good design for the MSC website. In this class, you have different goals to reach, so you have to be able to multitask. We have our teacher website to get done to go on the MSC website that we just started this year. We have this um, program on the computer, Dreamweaver, and that basically is a tutorial, like a, a guide on how to make websites. You just put in what you want, how you want it. Web design one, my freshman year, I didn't remember much, but then Mr. T started talking about it and showed us how to work with Dreamweaver, so I um, learned a lot on how to make websites. There was a website that he gave us, W2 Schooler, and it gives you, um, like, if you wanted to put links on your um, website, if you wanted to put text boxes in your website, if you wanted to, um, how to add pictures, the codes to add pictures, simple things that you'd find on a website. You look at them up on the code and then you just insert them here and then from there you write whatever you want. I made a, I made a teacher website. In MSU? Yep. We first we, we put like the basics down like what he teaches, his email and assignments and then we just showed him and he liked it. So. This is the humanitarian club and I'm doing this website. For a new club that started here in Lawrence High School, you're welcome to join us. So we have I'm doing this website. I'm doing also the What's Good on the Hood website. So I'm in the process of doing this one. Okay, so I'm making the MSD website. Mm -hmm. So that's the final product so far. Mm -hmm. We got the whole. Sometimes like you got stuck and like you don't know how to fix it, mm -hmm. but when you fix it, really cool. You're like, yes. Making the 2014 section of the website, and then next year we'll bump it up since we'll be seniors. Then it's mainly like opinions from all the juniors and MSC, so it'd be different things that we like, um, what we think about the school, how much we like about the school, like all the you could say all the activities we do as a class. In a way, you get to put your own personality into it. Like it's what you thought about it, like how you created it, the time that you took. It's like you're you're motivating yourself to do it. This is my first year. Yeah. So what they call you a rookie? Yeah. yeah. So actually, I'm a I'm a rookie also. I've this is my first time building really building these websites. For not right now, I'm creating robotics robotics website. These guys also helped me create it. I decided to add a little pizzazz to it. This is what we got so far. I even added some transitions and some animations for it. I'm going to present with them with the PowerPoint mm -hmm. and the Venture Project Celebration. And then we're going to have to make a website to show with our information we have here. We have to make our own website about robot robotics. Mm -hmm. I'm building one for Mr. Pichardo, which is the biology teacher. And this is what I got so far. Like every time you hit a link, it will go, it will have some information here. We just gotta um, talk with the teacher to see what he wants. I wanna connect his idea with my ideas to see if we can work it out, and we both like the website. I asked her what she wanted in the website. Mm -hmm. It's not on the website yet. Mm -hmm. I have to finish it. Mm -hmm. But once, it, once it's done? Yeah, when it's done, we're gonna put it on the website. This whole year, we've been working on websites. Um, building our own, building them for nonprofit organizations. So what we do is at the end of the year in May, um, we all, we took out the lecture hall for a day. And this is when all ties of the community, a bunch of people from the community are coming in as judges and as viewers to see what we've worked on all year. The students have to present. They choose um, a project that they've been working on that they feel like is the best that they've done and they present them in front of the judges. The winners that are chosen by the judges receive scholarships, first, second, third, 